convention. I have come to the London Expo um, Comic Con to come and meet Crystal, Holland, Daniel, and Hedlund, who are behind me. They're somewhere, and hopefully I'm going to get to talk to them. I might. I'll try to get a shot with them, try to say hello, uh, and try to get them to think what, what they would think of Styles if he were a girl, what that would make different in the show somehow, if it would make any difference. Right. Abrupt scenery change because my battery ran out while I was at the convention, so I had to leave the rest of the filming for until I got home, which is just now at 11ish. Um, mission accomplished, guys! I actually met everybody and I got to ask them my question and they were all super nice about it and just super nice in general and just seeing them was amazing. Just even seeing them from afar was kind of like, oh my god, there they are! But, but but seeing them in person and just like talking to them and shaking hands and asking them what they would think of Styles as a girl was awesome. Holland said that Lydia's first reaction would be uh, she'd be intimidated by Styles, which makes a lot of sense. And it was really cool to just discuss this with her. She. She said that she quite likes thinking outside the box like that, switching genders to characters and just sort of seeing what makes them tick, as opposed to just, like, taking them at face value, which is which is kind of what I like to do with gender run cosplay. It's kind of why I'm doing this as well. So, um, yeah, so th th that was an incredible conversation. Now, Hecklin and Daniel said that, um, well, I posed my question to them, and D Daniel couldn't really... Um, envision Styles as a girl. He said that basically what makes Styles who he is, like a big part of his identity, is him being a boy. He said that if Styles was a girl, he'd probably be a lot more protective of her. While Hecklin <laughs> said that if Styles was a girl, he'd just ignore her completely. Take that as you will, Steric fans. Daniel did go on to say that if Styles was a girl, Steric would basically be completely possible. Uh, Hecklin just sort of nodded along, just sort of begrudgingly. I didn't really want to breach the steric topic because I know that it's it's a big thing for them and it's not entirely what the show is about for me. So I just sort of steered the conversation more towards, you know, like character dynamics and, you know, purely from a theoretical point of view, steric aside. And um, that's what I got. And then I got to talk to Crystal, and I got to tell her how gorgeous she is, and that her hair is the seventh wonder of the world, and there should be a statue built to it. I actually... I actually said that. I basically told her about this whole gender bend thing, and she said that if Allison was a boy, he would be an athlete. He would probably go for something like a team sport, but like he'd be very competitive and really good at it, really dedicated. Um, and I asked, would he go for captain of the lacrosse team? And she said, maybe co-captain. That concludes my conversation with all four cast members who attended London Expo today. Thank you for watching, and yeah, it's been a surreal day. Yeah.